you're watching Starros Entertainment TV. Hi, this is Tyrone Tan with Starros Entertainment TV, and we're here in Studio City, California, at the Sportsman's Lodge for the 78th annual Southern California Motion Picture Council Holiday Awards event. So check us out here as we interview a lot of the celebrities and the guests here that attend the 78th annual Southern California Motion Picture Council Holiday Awards event on Starros Entertainment TV. Hi, this is Tyrone Tan with Star Wars Entertainment TV, and we're here with Gregory Hatanaka. Now, Gregory, what brings you out here to this wonderful event? Well, I've never been here, but I've heard about this event, the Motion Picture Council for the Awards, and I said, "Well, this is old Hollywood," and, and uh, Joe Williamson, my friend, invited me, and I want to check it out. It's it's fantastic. Awesome. Now, this show is about inspiring others. What or who in your life inspired you to become a filmmaker? Boy, my uh, my parents, mom and dad, and and a couple of school teachers that encouraged me to sort of seek the art and the art of film and anything artistic, you know, express yourself. Gotcha. Now, obviously, you've been inspired. What inspirational messages can you give to someone out there that maybe wants to become a filmmaker, a director, or just follow their dreams in general? Uh, you know, honestly, like, don't, don't let anybody tell you, like, you can't do it. Always, like, say, this is what the level is, you know, go higher because you can do it. You know, just reach out for it because anything is impossible. People are constantly rewriting rules and... Yes whatever's going on and setting the new bar you can do it you know awesome. now we want to help promote you in any way and I know you got something cooking and right, can you <laughs> talk to the audience here and I know we kind of promoted it on my on my radio show here Thank but you, uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, for the audience what uh, any projects any websites you got an audience right here well we're uh, about to go into production of Samurai Cup 2 Deadly Vengeance with uh, with the original cast from the first film and some new people and some veterans as well like Stuart Whitman Lorraine Landon you know uh, so we're shooting it. Uh, we start next week, and it's gonna be it's gonna be a fun uh, a fun picture, you know. That's awesome. Now what now? What was it about the first one for you to, to get involved to go? Hey, listen, I want to revive this movie and bring it back after how many years? And you know what was it about it? Like there had to be something about that movie that made you want to do it again. Well, I mean, first of all, you know, I like all movies, but I particularly like bad movies. I like I like grade Z movies. You know, v stuff that you would rent on VHS, and you say, okay, that's awesome. I love that cover. And the movie's like totally f***ed up. I was going to say that. Okay. Anyway, so, um, um, so, so, so I came across Summer Cup, uh, the original, uh, while shooting another film. And we, we restored the negative uh, to HD. We put it out. And little did we know, there's, there's fans and fans uh, of this film been developing. 18 to 25 video games, uh, clips, fan videos, that stuff. And, and uh, we said, boy, I mean, there's a market for this. Uh, there's, a di there's an obsessed audience for this kind of thing. We have the original cast back. Uh, now's the time to, to do this kind of picture, you know. Uh, and to and to pretend like we're in 1990 doing this sort of Andy Sedaris kind of kind of picture, you know, VHS, you know, lo-fi. It's awesome. Awesome. So uh, anything that the audience could that you're, you're going to do a little bit differently, or anything that you're going to be able to uh, pay homage, as well as what do you think you're going to add your little, uh, you know, little two cents as, as a filmmaker? Anything uh, that you're going to do? You know, you know. I mean, it's one of those films where it's like a unicorn. It's like it's one of those that it only comes along every 25 years, kind of thing. And and we're so fortunate to have the the original cast coming back. But you know, obviously, you know, I, I want to bring out what I liked from the first one. But I also want to bring it to this new generation. You know, so so obviously, like you you know, you make a movie on the red, it looks it looks instantly good. You can't you can't do anything to make it look bad like the first movie. So it'll it'll be glossier, but we hope that bringing the the characters back from the original is enough, and you get it. You know, the same characters, it's a little funnier, uh, you know, we give them more depth, and they're coming back to kick ass. It's going to be fun. It'll awesome. be a lot of fun. Yeah. Well, I wish you the best of luck. God bless you, you so much. Appreciate Again, uh, you know, check it out. Samurai Cop 2 coming out. And then, any websites, anything? Uh, not yet. We're on Facebook. It's like Samurai Cop 2. Look up Facebook, Samurai Cop 2 Deadly Vengeance. We have a Kickstarter page, and uh, yeah, thank you very much. Cool. Wish you the best of luck. Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays. Again, this is Tyrone Tan with... Gregory Hatanaka. And you're watching Star Wars Entertainment TV. So check out more episodes as we interview a lot more guests here that attend the 78th annual Southern California Motion Picture Council Holiday Awards event on Star Wars Entertainment TV.